keep carrying in the, in the newspapers. And uh, one question which always strikes me is like uh, we get releases about the initiatives taken by the police and secondly uh, crimes related, related to drug abuse and ganja and uh, what you call uh, gambling and things like that. We keep car carrying. And uh, apart from that, uh, when there are certain crimes which is reported by the media, like for example, a few months ago uh, there was a dead body of a lady which was found near a megaport on Carbon Stoke Road. So we carried the news, we tried to investigate and we were just waiting for a response from the police because it has, uh, it was like almost a dead body half naked in that area. We never get any response from the police like, I mean, in the form of press release, like what exactly is happening with the case. So uh, we would, uh, I would personally write, like to request you, it's like apart from gambling and bootlegging and all, uh, if there is some kind of crime which uh, the society wishes to know yeah, what exactly happened in this case. It creates a sensation and uh, all of a sudden there is a, a silence from the police. So this sends a very wrong signal. So, uh, uh, I should answer your question in two parts. You said was the lengthy part of this presentation. Right? So I don't know whether I should take it as a complaint or a compliment because we have done so much of work, work time. But, uh, it did take uh, time more than what it was required. Your second part is you are saying all the follow-up. 